Hello and welcome back. So, big day. We got a girlfriend. Look at this. It's it's it is a Russian necromancer who's also a force wielder and invisible chick sometimes, but uh, maybe that's her hobby. Uh, so we shall see. And uh, she said that she's gonna come back to a, a ship. Winky wink. So let's go. Thank you for helping me with Malikos. Thought I was a goner for a minute. Yes, you would have died. Right. I am glad you didn't. It is nice to have an ally. Yeah, I like the sound of that. You're welcome, Cal. Yes, hell yeah. We're warming up to each other. You should get what you came for. What? Oh yeah, uh, sure. I totally forgot what that was, but I I'm, I'm gonna get that. This place, it's... Who the fuck? Why not fix the... Fix the floor. Over here, BD. No, oh, no. Oh. oh. I'll be taking that. Finally found it. Yeah. It is real. Baron, this could be the key to the next generation of Jedi. Throw it in the pit. I'm happy for you. And your Jedi. But nothing can bring back my people. That's okay. The Jedi can be your people too. And me. Me and you. After the purge, <laughs> I was alone for a, a long time, in hiding. I was, oh man! I was scared that they'd find out who I was or what I was. What changed? A very good friend of mine told me to go out and find my place in the galaxy. And you listened? Well, no. Life has this funny way of forcing you on the path forward anyway. Now here I am. Or at least expected. A path forward. I will join you. Yes! Fuck yeah! You Woo! Will. I've spent years waiting for a chance to avenge my sisters. That's stupid. I'm finished waiting. I wish to fight by your side. Don't you dare turn her up. Travel together, but survivors, we adapt. Yeah. Come on, you can do yeah, better I than yeah. Do. What do you think, BD? No. I agree. My crew, they might take a little bit of convincing, though. Then we'll convince them. Okay. No, no turning invisible. Fuck that. Fuck that. One rule already. I'll already. No. No turning invisible. God damn it. Or Better you gotta teach me that. Then we both turn invisible. And creep out the crew. Oh, crap. <laughs> What are you doing? Come with me. Use the hollow table on the mantis. No, I don't want to fight those There's guys. No there is now. Did you raise the ones before too? I did. I wanted to see how you would handle Malikos. You were testing me? And you passed. Congratulations. Are you gonna help me with this? I'm sure you can handle it. <laughs> Don't be so sure about that. We have to kill these guys. To impress the girl. Fuck 
me. What? I thought he was dead. Still here, BD. I guess I guess we can accept that. This woman you travel with. Who is she? See her? Wait, how do you know about her? I have seen your companions. Marikos wanted me to attack them, but they posed no threat. See her, um. Well, she used to be a Jedi. It's a long story. I would like to learn it. I would like to learn it? I'll meet you at your ship. Can you teach me teleportation? Okay. Now let's rest. No, 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 I, I didn't want out. It was a mistake. I regret clicking that button. Ooh, dude. Come on, buddy. Oh, these guys. All right, all right. Combo time. Oh, you're in trouble. Uh, what? No, I didn't want to. Oh, my. He's quick, huh? Get him. A little help, bud. No, 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 no. I don't, last thing I want is fall, fall down. Take it off. Watch this. What happened? Buddy. Can I take it? Okay, okay. I can't wait to bring you in! Got him! Flamethrower is a good choice. Atticus Rex defeated, sure. So, where am I going? Just, just the straight path back to the ship? I'm kinda getting a little familiar with that. Not the worst. Yeah, I definitely don't want to go down. What am I saving here? Go straight. I, I don't think we need to. Big words. Wait. Oh no no. I'm I'm on the right path. It's not that far away, even though we need to sprint the whole way and ignoring everything. It would be a little longer without that. Uh, I hope you just didn't just come up without me. Oh. Found it. Oh, well, who's this? Yeah, yeah, exactly. What's that supposed to mean? It means I'll be joining you. Seer, Grease, this is Marin. She's a witch, isn't she? A night sister. Your fear is unnecessary. I couldn't have gotten the Astrium without her. We fought Malakos together. I trust her. Wow. And we trust you. Wow. You <laughs> will have to earn it. Some seed. Don't even try anything funny. Welcome aboard. Sure. Okay. They like you. I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> All right. We can save. New ally. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Hell yeah. We needed that! Finally! I, I, I was hoping for this for so long! This is what I want! Bigger ship! Of course, this is a little bit, bit of a tiny ship, so... I don't know, it's gotta be a tight squeeze. 
But whatever. We're gonna make it work. I just went for a little bit of rest. Cal, care to join me? Uh, Breeze has gone outside for once. Sure. Figured I'd take the time to rest. Not a On bad this idea. planet? You two have spent a lot of time together. I think have? it's Marin's turn to enjoy oh, his okay. charm. <laughs> think she can handle it? He's superstitious enough to give her space. <laughs> Relatively speaking. Makes me want to learn magic. <laughs> Seriously. She's standing right there. What the fuck? What are you thinking about? How quiet it is. I don't know if it's because Grease is off the ship or something else. Hang on. It's always good to give yourself a moment to think and reflect. What about you? You don't want to talk. Grease, you're off the ship? Where are you? Like, this is not a planet where you want to go too far. I hate to point out that our the most friendly person, our best friend, is a necromancer who raised the dead on this planet. And it just goes downhill from there. Grease is not here. Where are where is he? I guess I'm I just I guess he's just gonna show up. I can't find him. So much to see. We'll see as much as we can, buddy. Back to Bogano. Okay. After a long time. Bogano it is. The but what would be cool is that this Cordova guy is really putting some wear people actually come ship. with me on the mission. Always wanted to explore the whole galaxy. And did you? We explored many planets, tombs and temples related to the Zepho and Jedi. But I hit a limit. To him, there was no limit. The poor crazy old guy was left alone. He was always alone, even when I was with him. He cared about his work and the future more than anything else. He didn't have the time. He was always on the move. Magana was the first place I ever saw that looked like he settled. Even for a brief moment. All right, we're here. Get in your chair. Wait. You just... You just good? What about her? Do I need to sit in the chair? I thought I, I had to. But now I'm questioning it. Jesus. Really not saying too much. You think it'll work? It worked for Cordova. You can make it work. She's right. Oh, hey, is anybody hungry? I, I was thinking of whipping up some scaz steaks. I'm sorry, am I interrupting? No, Captain. And we couldn't have gotten this far without you. Oh, <laughs> well, uh, it's true, Grease. Thank you. Hey, I hope you get in there and you find that hollow thing. Holocron. Are you sure it's something you should find? Good question. What do you mean? The children on that list. If you take them from their homes to train as Jedi, won't they be hunted like you? Excellent point. It has to be kept out of the hands of the Empire. It'll help us put an end to the Empire. Oh, yeah, hey, but uh, no, that that sounds bad to you. They're very oh, bad. Please. <laughs> yeah. I take my steak rare. Huh. Huh? Okay. Now we're cooking. <laughs> As you know. I mean, I saw her culture. It's not that civilized. <laughs> He made a good point. Grease is like the... Grease is kind of fun. Siri is just terrible. All around terrible. No, no redeeming quality whatsoever. I'm not saying like, you know, she's bad. And like, you know, she's like a bad person. And like, you know. No, no. Trio Love was kind of fun bad. I mean, even this guy was kind of fun bad. Trio Love was a little bit more fun bad. But like, Siri is just terrible. I don't like her. Like... Our new companion had an excellent point. Do we have even the right? Because we don't. We don't have the right. 
and the children can never make the choice. So this mission is totally dead because the children can never make the choice. We cannot ever propose this to their parents. The only way this would be ethically justifiable if they were hunted already and the empire had the list as well. That's the only way. And then, then we can, you know, go offer uh, help. And Siri actually had a terrible point. Like, yes, I mean, Siri is just way too focused on the big picture of, like, defeating the Empire. But that's not going to work with a bunch of fucking children. And she actually just wants to take the children to be used as weapons. Horrendous. So, I think if I'm ever going to be given a choice, which is basically... Close to 0% in this game. But maybe I will have a choice of yes or no at the end. Then then I will probably choose to destroy the list. Just to make sure no one gets it. Not Siri. Especially, I don't trust Siri at all. It, it just, it just, Siri just proved to me right now. That she not, she can never be trusted with the list. She cannot even glimpse at the list. No. Terrible. No, not not happening. You know, the thing is with the force power, and I, it's cool if you have it, but you don't you don't really need it, you know, to be to be, you know, to, to have a fulfilled life, do you? No, you don't. And and not like, you know, if you have it, now you have to like you have to be like a Jedi, you know. Why why is the question can you know, why is not like, you know, I, I'm not really feeling it. I don't want to be a Jedi. I don't want to be a Sith. You know, just leave the fuck alone. You know, leave me the fuck alone. Like it can be that an option. Hey. Oh, wait up. Wait up for what? I know you're about to get that hollow cron. Nice. You remembered. You joining me? Oh no, no, absolutely not. No. I just wanted to say, you know, those those kids we're supposed to find. They're lucky to have you. They're lucky to have us. We're in this together, Grease. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't hoping you'd say that, because, you know, they're gonna need more than fancy magic tricks. Oh, uh, yeah? Practical guidance, role model, someone to look up to. You know, ship flying's a complicated art. But that's only if I stick around. I remember that. Good. Good. Okay. Good luck, buddy. You and Marin getting along? Oh, yeah. I mean, she still freaks me out. You know, the whole raising the dead thing. But as long as she doesn't kill me. <laughs> she won't. You'll be all right. Oh, yeah, yeah. You said that before. And, then... and you're still alive. For now. Nothing will happen to you. We're all in this together, Grease. Funny to have this thing end where it started. Oh, Was yeah. it ending? I remember our first visit here. I've said it before. I really didn't think you were... A Jedi? Jedi or not, I just didn't think you were the guy. And now? Now? Jedi or not, you are. Look, I still don't quite get the whole Force stuff, but what I do know is that you are one tough kid. Thanks. So are you. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I do look young for my age. <laughs> Hurry up here, I'm hungry. Might try a new recipe for smoked kadu ribs. No. Oh. He's going to die. <laughs> uh. There's something weird about this place. The energy is different here. Yeah, it's different than Dathomir. Yes. Dathomir is intricate. Its ancient power emanates from the shadows. Bagano feels more simplistic, and yet... I can't figure it out. Bagano is special. There's a reason the Zeppo built their vault here. Where your holocron waits. Hidden. What are you getting at? This planet has remained nearly untouched for centuries. Were the lives you seek to protect really in danger before you intervened? You make some excellent points here. Who wrote this character? Uh, hand off to you. Finally, a character I like. I mean, I mean, I kind of like Grease, but he's more like the comedy, comedy. It's not really a comedy relief. I think he's just he's just a like simple guy. I mean, he, he's good. He's, he's the excellent pilot, but I feel like you know, like he's not really the one who shines. He's not really suited for like a crew of two or three. Like if you well, if you can't think me, 
Like he's, he's he's fine, you know. He's like he's the he's like the Joker of Mass Effect. He's he's fine. He's fine for that. But like he's not he's not not like a companion. He's not a companion. He's just he's a really good pilot, you know. He's fun. Like I like him. I like him for that. But he's not a companion. He's not really giving me input. He said like he, he just like you know just like I just do whatever the fuck I want. Which is which is fa fine, fine, fine. But she, Melina, I believe that's her name is. She's actually giving me input and very good input. We're definitely not on Dathomir anymore. No, we are not. Marion. How you imagined? The rest of the galaxy, I mean. It is so vast. I see now my life on Dathomir was limited. I felt the same way about leaving Braca. The world can feel small when you're trapped by the past. I think I will like my time aboard the Mantis. The Jedi retrain will help build a galaxy that respects and preserves special places like this one. And that is their choice or yours? We need each other to survive. Without the Jedi, I don't know if we can. We have a responsibility to protect them. So you've said. You Jedi should focus on doing rather than talking. Excellent point. Marion, I like you a lot. Cal, about a second? Yeah. You've been through a lot to get here. But the vault is still an unknown. Cordova put the holocron inside. That's what's important. I have to get it. Cordova built danger into this test to protect it. You're worried about me. I don't want to train all those younglings alone. I'll be fine, Seer. Plus, I've got BD with me. I know. Just be careful. This might be unlike anything you two have faced before. Thanks. We're ready. The both of us. Take care of each other. Why are you all so useless? I mean, Greasy not coming with me on the mission makes perfect sense. Siri, you're not coming with me on the mission makes no fucking sense. Marin, you're not coming with me on the mission. Maybe justified, you know, you're like the new new girl, you know, I mean, this is something may I may have to do a lot. I, I could, I would definitely expect and kind of hope you would come with me later, but I think this is just going to be a solo mission every time. Are you ready for what comes next? Yes, and so are you. I've seen it. You've learned a lot from all this, Cal. And from you. That's kind of you to say. Oh my God. I won't be in the vault with you. Yeah, you will. Just in a different way. Oh my god. I'm glad we found you, Cal. Good luck in there. And remember, think before you react. I suspect Cordova left behind a test not just anyone could solve. May the Force be with you. Remember when you first brought me here? It's hard to believe how far you've come in such a short time, Cal. Yeah. Hey, maybe when we train the younglings, we'll do it my way. I have a few ideas that don't include life or death situations. Cal, don't be stupid. <laughs> You'll never train someone your way. Both people have to be willing to learn. Thanks. For everything. Anytime. Yep. That's maybe not the... Maybe, maybe the first not stupidest thing you've ever said, Siri. BD1, keep an eye on Cal for us. <sighs> Alright. But not the whole thing. God damn it. So, where are we going? We are going towards the big temple and the fastest way toward the big temple is unclear. Oh, we can pull down a bridge there. I think going to the right might be the best. Let's move, BD. Oh yeah, we, we had no way of doing that earlier. So I suspect this is the way the game wants me to go. Kind of. You can just drop down, but that might be... Not the best. We can pull the bridge. Again, we need pulls for this. Totally not possible earlier. Ready to move on? We also have to swing.
Two big frogs, three big frogs. I would like to fight exactly zero of them. Even if I have to leave the box behind. Alright. We're at the temple. My big frog. I'm sensing something weird. This Maybe the master's strange, alive. But I think it's the astrium. The closer we get to the vault, the stronger it feels. I mean, Cal. I, I hate to <laughs> be the one who. Careful, buddy. We still don't know how this thing works. Point at the obvious, but obviously you were tricked into getting this list. But was it Siri? I don't think so. Siri might just be incompetent, beyond belief. I wouldn't have a big problem with that, but she just endangers people. And, like has some big ideas. Oh, I can go in. Oh, never mind that. Where am I supposed to go? Huh. I don't remember. Fuck, fuck, stop, stop, stop. I definitely... Great. There was no way to stop. <laughs> we have to come <clears throat> down all the way. So this is open. Here we go, BD. Oh. Okay. Oh, if you... Oh, okay, never mind that. If you go in the other way, then you just come out. I'm gonna just put in a tennis ball. It'll be good. Amazing. The vault itself is built like a giant holocron. I linked something about that wall. We're close. Yeah. Let's check it out. I could have just brought a drill. Save myself a lot of trouble. I offer this record of our civilization to those who will follow. Despite our wisdom and technological achievement, we face extinction. Dogma blinded us to the path of balance, and gradually we allowed our pride to corrupt us. The greater control we sought, the further we found it to ruin. I lead the remnants of my people into the great unknown, hoping that we will finally find peace. Oh, box? We can't interact with the box. I shall teach them the ways of the Force. Master Custis. We shall begin with physical preparation. What is the Force? Gather round, everyone. Master Kestis, do you think the Empire will find us? Cal, I really hope we're gonna have a, a decision here, not just... Wait, what? I can't open the map. Not just... Oh yeah, let's teach children and, you know... Deal with the obvious betrayal of somebody. Or, there's gonna be a twist, because there's always a twist. It's not gonna be like, oh yeah! And then Cal and Siri uh, set up a camp and everything is happy. It's the Empire! Master, shall we fight them? The Inquisitors have found us. They're coming! To the trenches! 
Keep going! Protect yourself! Capture the younglings. Kill the rest. They're fast! They're firing! Looks like he's having a bad time. Oh crap. <laughs> Surrender now, and we may spare the youngest. That's right. On your knees. Different armor on. Oh, look at that. feeling I'd see you here. Oh? How uncharacteristically prescient of you. Here I thought your greatest virtue was your dogged persistence as you stumbled from one debacle to the next. Guess you made a mistake not killing me on Brock at that. A scant mercy. I waged one meaningless Padawan against a prize that will win me the Emperor's favor. You think I'm gonna let you walk away with the Holocron? Of course not. We both have our pride. But yours has cost you the lives of all the four sensitive children on that list, as well as your own. Like you said, Trilla, I'm persistent. Destroy the holocron, you did. Careful with that thing. 
It's been through hell. Don't go. We need to stick together. No. I'm going to lure them away, and then I'm going to circle back. Stay with the young ladies, Trilla. May the force be with you. Master! Don't leave us! Trilla, what's going to happen? She just did a run for it. It's okay. I'll have to keep this bait. about everything. How surprising. It was not the time for a history lesson. Cal. You left the Oh my god. Visitor is born. Let me know that information. Now we have to go back to the ship. We fucked it up. I fucking knew it, Vivo. As I suspected it. Anyway, uh, time to take a break. Uh, thanks for watching, guys, and see you next time.